BCBE, what's up? It's me, Amiel, coming to you with another beer review. Today we have Tall Grass, The Grizz. This is an Imperial IPA. It weighs in at about 9.5 ABV. All right. I picked up this beer as I roam, rummaged through one of my local beer uh, houses. And, you know, one of the things I try to do in finding something special outside of watching BCBE and the awesome beers you guys select is, uh, you know, I like bottle art. And I also like to note sometimes it's the last beer in the rung, right, in a row. I'm like, hmm, the Grizz is the last one, bottom shelf. Let me see what the deal is, right? Wasn't too expensive either. Jumping right into this beer, and again, this is Tall Grass Brewery, and this is the Grizz. It's an Imperial IPA. Again, weighs in at 9.5 ABV. The appearance of this beer, as you can see, is nice golden honey looking appearance to it. It's pretty pleasing in its appearance. Pours with a nice thick pillow top head um, with some heavy noted bubbles that uh, break it up and, and dissipates in decent time. As you note, there's some awesome lacing that remains on this glass. The aromas of this beer are classic Imperial IPA in that it is piney, um, that they, it is uh, grassy, to some degree, it is um, tropical fruit sweetness, um, overly malty in my view, um, but again, a pleasing, piney, classic uh, Imperial IPA uh, aroma this beer gives off. The taste of this beer follows the nose in that the pine IPA-like um, grab is there, but it doesn't necessarily take true uh, uh, hold of the tongue. It stops because the sweetness takes over. Um, this beer is balanced, yet slightly on the malty sweetness side. So if you're not an IPA lover, uh, you might like this beer if you wanna try some IPAs because it is less piney, less bite-like. Um, however, it is a nice representation. I'm gonna rate this beer 3.0. Now, not because it doesn't meet the specs of an IPA or an Imperial IPA, but it's nothing special. Uh, tall grass and a lot of guys need to know that there are some awesome brews out there and there's some amazing things going on. Uh, for a representation of an Imperial IPA, this is decent out of the can. Um, I am not upset, uh, but it's not likely I would uh, push a little kid out of the way to grab this one if I see it again. It's a decent beer, though. So... Again, this is uh, Amiel, and I hope everybody's out there having an awesome beer day, great beer life, and I'll uh, talk to you guys in the near future. Peace and love.